Effective conservation science relies on a detailed understanding of the species that you're interested in. Um, so for species that are little known, it's really important to have a behavioural and ecological understanding of them uh, before you start working out what you need to do to try and protect them. My research is investigating the effects of temperature on two uh, range-restricted Ethiopian bird species. Uh, the first is the Ethiopian bush crow, whose range has been found uh, to be described almost perfectly by a climate envelope. Uh, my second study species is the white-tailed swallow, um, and this is even less well known than the bush crow. Because the two species are quite taxonomically different, being a crow and a swallow, it's likely that the, um, the mechanisms operating on the two species are different. The white-tailed swallow nests in village huts, and so when I was carrying out a nesting study on the birds, I had to revisit villages uh, every few days for a two-month period in order to record the progress of the nests. This provided me with ample opportunity uh, to get to know villagers and to talk to them about what I was doing. Local engagement is also important um, because in southern Ethiopia tribal law is, is very very strong um, and so without the will of the local Burana leaders even the national park and the protection that it's supposed to bring to the species will be ineffective. My PhD is funded by um, the Natural Environment Research Council as part of their case programme. And this means that uh, in addition to the funding from NERC, I receive additional funding and support from the Royal Society for the Protection of Birds, the RSPB, who are one of the major CCI partners. I also work with Nigel Collar from BirdLife International, uh, who provides other support and advice. And through the BirdLife partnership, I work with um, the Ethiopian BirdLife partner, uh, the Ethiopian Wildlife and Natural History Society. By communicating my results with uh, EWNHS, it allows them to use, the, use my findings to influence conservation decisions on the ground in the Burana National Park where the Ethiopian bushcrow and the white-tailed swallow are found.